Hi guys, welcome back to another Little Geeky Reviews. This time we are going to go through Donatello, the heroic turtle at arms from the Turtles of Grey Skull line. So he comes in this shocking type of pearlized purple. Round the back, with the actual card art itself, he is the Tackle and Beastman outside of Castle Grey Skull. And then you've got the little cross cells, the same thing with the shell popping off his back. And then the other waves that it came out with as well. So let's crack this guy open and have a little closer look. So he does come with the original comic with the first wave by the power of pizza. We've gone through this one before with the review from Leo. What I'm loving first off is this big mace accessory. Now I haven't got man at arms yet, but the accessory itself, it's like his bow staff mixed with man at arms as mace, but it's got a little clip on the end here. Now I believe if you do get man at arms, his mace will connect to this one. It's pretty, pretty sturdy type of mace as well. The actual detail has got the little shell on the top part of it. I'm loving that. It's well cool. The armour on Donatello, although it's absolutely great. I love this colour. It's probably one of my favourite colours. Where you've got Leo and also um, Wrath, the majority of all the actual armour can pop off. Now, the thing is with Donatello, this helmet is a permanent fixture. So you could take all off the armour, but he would still have this stuck on, which I don't know why they've done that. So I'm a bit gutted over that one. The other accessory is obviously his shell, which pops off, and that can become his little shield. But just to show you, the actual um, how he looks like without the armor we'll go through that so but the articulation all the same with the origins head bubbles off and obviously pops off the head let's see the actual bandana as well where the others all twist around this one is stuck and fixed in as well so it does only go that one way The 360 on the arms and they do pop off so we can slide all of this stuff off as well as we're going. I like his little um, gun cannons is it? His little laser cannons attached to his armour there. So there he is without all of his armour. I mean yeah I think the only thing that does let it down is that the helmet doesn't come off so but you can tell the difference with all the different colors where they are keeping that in line so just bring Wrath and Leo back in so he's more of like Donatello's more of like a pea green type of look on him and there he is back all in his armor gear so let me know your thoughts on Donatello do you think the same way as me with the actual helmet or are you all right with the actual helmet being stuck on there? Also, have you gone down this route with the turtles? Are there only certain ones that you are going to collect if that be the case? Let me know your thoughts. Let me know your comments. While you're there dropping those comments, do the usual with like, subscribe and tickle that little bell notification so you don't miss out on any others. Well, thanks for checking in on this one, and I will see you on the next. Take care.